Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to a brand new unboxing. I haven't had too many unboxings on the channel lately, so I figured I might bring some, bring this back. And, um, why don't I start off with a decent look at the speaker. I picked this up at JBL.com for just about $50. It is the JBL Clip 2. It's a Bluetooth speaker. It's also IPX7 waterproof, so hopefully it's good. I'm looking forward to checking this out and for you guys as well. I'm also going to do some review for this when I have had a while to actually use this device. Anyways, let's get dive right into it. Simply there's just some tape back here. I'm just going to grab my little knife and cut her open. Perfect. This will act this side next to these little guys over here. Well, there goes the dog. So, so I'm going to just flip this up. Okay, and first you're greeted with your micro USB to charge, since this is does have a built-in battery. I'm not, I'm not quite sure. Okay, yes, it does have eight hours of playback, so you're gonna get a decent amount of battery life with this. I was personally expecting more, but it's a uh, smaller boot speaker. It's nothing, not the biggest in the market, but it definitely is good. Okay, so I'm gonna simply now just pull this straight out of the box. Oh, and right down here we're greeted with our paperwork. Won't you look at that? If you'll excuse me. Back to the video. Okay. So, right here, you can see that you get your paperwork. I'm assuming this is the simple instructions. I'm not quite sure how exactly to use this, but we'll get to this later so I can set it up fully. But pulling this little guy right out of here. This, wow, it has some decent weight to it, I gotta say. I kinda, I do like this clip up top, I can say that right now, because it can be easy if you're clipping on your backpack or your bike, or if you're just out somewhere and you need, need something easy to clip it onto, or in, even if you're in the shower, I think it might be good. Clip it right, clip, clip it right on the inside of it, and you are good to go. So this actually has some pretty decent weight to it, I can say that right now, because most Bluetooth speakers have, okay, all Bluetooth speakers are a little bit different. This one is definitely unique. It's, um, if I like it because it fits nicely in the palm of your hand. And one thing also I'm seeing right here is the optional 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. iPhone 7 does not get any love with this, except if it's Bluetooth, which obviously it is. So, if this is if you want to use a um, pair of um, audio devices that does not support Bluetooth. I kind of like how it's tethered there. I'm not quite sure how long this will actually last because of how thin this actually is. And judging by, I'm gonna come over to uh, this little camera over here. Judging by how thin I'm a cable this is at the very tip, I'm not sure how long that will last on there, but I think it might hold up well. I'm not sure. I'll tell you guys in that in my review. So to be honest, this isn't half bad. I see it with the controls right on the side. And it also does have a speakerphone, so you can have an incoming call. I actually believe it does. I think it does not. Yes, it does. And also, again, as I said, it does It does have IPX7 waterproof. Um, so, yeah. And right over here, you have your charge port. And your Bluetooth on, Bluetooth off, and your volume controls. And I believe that the call button also serves as the um, pause play button. Which I'm assuming. I'm not sure. I'll figure that out. I think you can also skip tracks for it. I'm not sure. I'll have to look into that user's manual. But yeah, it's uh, I'm, I'm, it's an interesting little speaker, I gotta say. For I, I got it for 50 bucks um, because I had a coupon in the system because I had a defective pair of headphones a while back and they couldn't take them back because they were um, because they were an older unit and they're like they're like here. This is your one-time offer. Here's a coupon code to go purchase this. So I got these for a little bit less than what they originally go for. But yeah, I gotta say, this is this is nice. I like this little clip here. Empty. Um, yeah, I got I gotta say I like it. And test also also test be testing the waterproof up to bring it to the beach and everything. I'm pretty excited for this. And speaking of Bluetooth speakers, I haven't uploaded it yet. I'm very sorry. My Skull Candy Air Raid um, video, I haven't done that review yet, mainly because I'm still trying to play with it around. It's a little iffy. It's a little iffy because it's been off. Anyways, this is this video is about this little guy. Um, I gotta say, it is definitely pretty cool. I'll definitely get the review for you guys up for this. And I just, what I what I would typically do with this is give this a month for a test, and then I'll come back. And again, speaking of the skull candy, I have not. I've spent a few months with that because I'm still trying to give my, my initial thoughts. 
it has been a little iffy with its controls. But anyways, setting that aside, this is, it seems like a pretty good speaker. I'll give this my own opinion then. It seems I have to go down with this. So, anyways you guys, I appreciate you stopping by to check out this video. I think this is a cool little guy. I'll leave a link for this guy right down in, in the description. And an unboxing of the Skull Candy speaker, which I keep talking about. I'll leave that right on screen, wherever in this video. Anyways you guys, I appreciate you stopping by. And until next time, stay tuned for more.